It's no days off. Take no breaks. You in my lane. You in my way. We got a meeting in the French Quarter in five minutes, and we can't be late. Go ahead, lead the way. What you do anyway. What's that supposed to mean? If you got a problem with me, come out and say it. First Kai, now this Ormstrand. Forgive me if I feel like a puppet in all of this. You reached out to us, remember? Your friend Sebastian is gonna help bring down two deadly organizations, Tatakul and Ormstrand's Empire. I guess I'm nervous about being back on US soil. How about we blow off those dust sheets with a sprint? Uh, hello? Okay, sure. I'll meet you there. Oh, I see. It's like that, is it? Nice cornery, but you'll need to be faster to beat me. It take you any day. Maybe one day, but not this day. That's a nice car you got. Shame about the color, though. But bright red is so unique. Excuse the interruption, ladies, but who exactly are we meeting again? One of our crew's been working deep undercover. If he's doing his job, they won't know he's there. Yo, man. Still waiting on my ride. Don't you know what chop chop means? That's your undercover guy? Wait, I recognize him. He's a friend of Tej. Roman something. Yeah, Roman something, all right. Wait here a minute. Let me find out what's up. <laughs> Excuse me, ladies. Come on, Letty. This shit ain't cool. You're gonna blow my cover. No, for real. Tonight I'm running some huge op that's inside a bad guy speak for operation. Never would have guessed. I'm just waiting for the call. Now, who are you two? <sighs> Vienna Cole. I used to race with Tej back in Miami. They've been helping us with the Moroccan op. Right on. So what you gotta understand is that I've spent weeks working my way up the ladder. I'm practically running the whole thing now. Impressive. Yeah, that'll be my secret terrorist network contact. I'm supposed to deliver something important to the big boss himself tonight. OK, keep us posted. Damn, Letty. You don't think I know what I'm doing by now? All right, cool. I gotta bounce. I got a whole criminal organization to run. Hey, man, where am I headed? Subtle, that one. Hit me up with an address. Who do you think you're talking to, Aaron boy? No address. You just go where I tell you. Now take a left up ahead. You want to go north on the freeway towards Seabrook. What in the hell is over in Seabrook? Then your goddamn business. Take the on-ramp here. Up. The boss 
cops won't like it if you're late with his delivery. You guys came to me because you wanted skill and experience. You came to me because you want the best. Your ass is still on probation as far as the boss is concerned. Consider this a test. A test? After all I've done for you guys? <laughs> Shit, let's see how you do tonight. Man, this shit better not be about no damn cigar. What was that? Long story. This is why I drive supercars and you drive trucks. Where the hell are we going? Take this right. We're going towards Lakefront. Man, this is just stupid. Bad guys can't get their packets delivered closer to the city? Left again. You're real close now. Finally. You're the worst backseat driver ever. Okay, I'm here. Now what? Lamar? This better not be no setup. Hey there. How you doing this fine evening? Not a good idea for you to be all alone out here this late. Sure, get on in. Guess you know a strong, protective man when you see one. And I know a gorgeous, aggressive woman yes. when I... 911? I'd like to report a crime. No, no, no. Hold on, hold on. 
You're the one who got in my car. A police officer is shot and bleeding out. Corner of Townsend and Harbor. Please, hurry. I saw a silver Aston Martin with New York plates pulling away from the scene of the crime. Where's the package I'm supposed to pick up? Is that it? I'm the package. Welcome to part two of the test. Let's just call it evasive maneuvers. Now drive. We're going to this destination. Listen, lady. I ain't the criminal version of Uber. All units, all units. 1199, officer down. Repeat, officer down on the corner of Harbor and Townsend. Respond code 3. EMS are on route code 10. Anonymous tip reports the silver Aston Martin with New York license plate leaving the area. Supervisor is incoming and will advise we pass him. Send the whole district after us? Get rid of them. I'll make sure they don't fight. Are you crazy? Actually, don't answer that. This just went to 11 real fast. You are so concerned about the lives of those police officers. Perhaps you are one as well. Me? A cop? Hell no. How about I show you my prison task from back in Barstow later? If there is a lady. Keep throwing those things out the window, and we'll have a whole damn city looking for us. You have another way to stop them? Actually, I do. Next level James Bond shit. 1156. Officers are encountering heavy resistance from the suspect vehicle on the 1199 case. Passenger is throwing explosives from the car. Secondary and backup units are closed six to remain at a five-block radius. Maybe you'll pass these tests Boss man can throw all the tests he wants at me. I've been rolling with you guys for months now. I got this. You won't always have your fancy gadgets, but at least now I know you can improvise. Get rid of the rest of them. All the tests he wants at me. I've been rolling with you guys for months now. I got this. You won't always have your fancy gadgets, but at least now I know you can improvise. Get rid of the rest of them. Yo, suckers, double or nothings.
think we're losing them. I hope you're gonna leave me a big tip after that. I assume I passed in? You talk too much. We're still on for drinks later, right? Mr. Piers, I heard you ran into some trouble with the local law enforcement. Oh, was that what I saw in my rear view? I was going too fast to notice. Then it appears you're exactly the driver we need for a rather delicate operation. You know I'm the only man for the job, right? Did you ever order something online, only to never have it appear on your doorstep? Ah, sure. That sucks, man. Immensely frustrating. Especially if it's something you specifically wanted, and you can't have it... ...just because some idiot screwed up on the delivery. Fortunately, there is a replacement. One that will satisfy my requirements after some adjustments. Right, right on, man. Are you up to the task, Mr. Pierce? Does fast food cure a hangover? Good luck, Mr. Pierce. My son Kai will give you the details. Oh, wait. This is your pops? Roman. Okay. I got a top secret mission, and I'm gonna need two things. What's that? First, some cars. I mean, serious cars. Okay, what else? I'm gonna need some kind of signal scrambler, because what they want me to steal can never be turned on. Ormstrid found himself another Eclipse device. I've been thinking of a way to jam it. Leave it with me. Yeah, the big boss man was pretty upset that his son, Kai, lost the first one. Wait. Did you say Kai? Yeah. Kai is Ormstrid's son? And you saw him tonight? Saw him? I could have reached out and smacked him. Huh. What are we waiting for? First, we meet up with Dom. Now this 
is what I'm talking about. Hey, what's up? Deja vu. Maybe this is where our luck turns around. How did you find out about this race? Every city, every town in America has got a race. Tell me again why Interpol can't just give us some cars. Roman's supposed to be this lone wolf wheelman. They expect him to find his own rights. So where are they? Dominic Toretto, welcome to the Big Easy. Mahalia, I got a business proposition for you. Anything for a legend like you. We need some cars. Ah, uh, that I can't do. Look, Dom, what's mine is yours. But this whole thing is legit. I've heard the rumors of what you do with cars nowadays. And I can't have it traced back to me or what we built here. Great. So what do we do now? What we do best. Respectfully? Nobody in their right mind would consider going up against you in this race. True. But I'm not going to be the one behind the wheel. This is no amateur event, sweetheart. What'd you bring? 500 kilowatts, 750 horsepower, and 0 to 60 in 2.8 seconds fast enough for you? Sweetheart? Fair enough. We'll see if your sleeper car can keep up with these. Ladies, gentlemen, and everyone in between, today you are all racers. Winner takes all. And as you can see, these prizes are exquisite. Two laps around this fine city of ours. Keep it between the barriers and give the crowds a show that will go down in history. Drivers, you better be ready. This is the ride of your life. On my mark. Don't embarrass me in front of these gas guzzlers. This city is actually quite beautiful. If I wasn't speeding by it at a million miles per hour... Gotta use all the track here. Ugh. 
spread each apex. I'm smaller and more agile than those beasts. I can do this. Here we go, second lap. of the lap now. Gotta bring it home. I'm gonna do it! Corners, focus. Where'd you find Cam, anyway? You know, I'm realizing now, I think they found me. I was 10. They were a few years younger. They were new to the neighborhood. And their parents constantly left them alone. And one night, I caught them trying to get into my house. They were scared. They. <sighs> I just wanted someone to play with. What did you do? I guess I could have yelled for my parents. But they were crying. So we just played. Talked about cars. And after that, we hung out all the time. We've been through a hell of a lot together. What about their parents? Let's grab the pinks for the cars. Dom's probably halfway to Roman with the scrambler by now.
You're right, Dom. Cam's got skills. Miami through and through. We're stashing the cars for Roman now. I'll send you the coordinates. See you back at this. kind of exposed out here, you know what I'm saying? It's hard to be all undercover out here in the open. I'm three minutes out. Okay, man, I'm at the old theme park. Talk to me, Roman. No, man, I'm good, I swear. I mean, I've already been pushed out of a plane. I've already been harpooned and damn near drowned, which means I'm pretty down for anything, right? When in doubt, do what I do. I've seen what you do. That's why I'm kind of terrified. I will have eyes on you the whole time. Kicking back with drinks while you watch me splatter my brains all over the place. Yeah, I feel better already. Maybe you've been undercover so long you've forgotten who you are. And who's that? Roman Pierce, who drives with the best crew in the world. <laughs> That's right, I am. Man, I got this. I ain't got this, this shit is crazy. What'd you say? We're doing this, unless you're having second thoughts. You'd better not screw this up. Hey, your daddy called in the best. Let me worry about the rest. You don't know a thing about me or my father. You're an errand boy, nothing more. Yeah, an errand boy who hooked us up with supercars. So show a little respect, homie. Follow me to our infiltration point. No comms from now on until I tell you. How are we supposed to get through these docks without being spotted? We're not going through the docks. What? Shut up, man. It's supposed to be a stealth mission. Hey, you're talking too. Both of you quiet.
lazy ass. Driving on a cargo ship. Great. First submarines, now cargo ships. Can't someone hide their doomsday devices on the beach in the Bahamas? Oh, hell no! Should have stole some monster trucks, not supercars. Okay, I think we've been spotted now. Continue the mission. My father will not accept failure. Dude, failure is sitting in our laps and wiggling around. Damn it, Roman, focus! Device is on the USS Rademacher. Get on board, and then you're up. That ain't gonna fit in the trunk. That's what your harpoon is for, imbecile. I'd be lying if I didn't tell you that my heart was beating out my chest right now. Where are you guys going? Hey! This ain't a heist without a team. Watch out above. Avoid the gunfire from those towers. Man, we start World War III. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I'm on your side. Kinda. Roman, take it easy. You take it easy. You ain't in the middle of a war zone. I know you're dragging that heavy container, but you can use it. What? Remember Rio? Use the container. Like a wrecking ball, right? I got it. Halfway there now. Get to the rendezvous point. They scrambling just on us! Ignore them. They're too fast to accurately track us. Watch my back, Lamar. More guards in the towers. Now this is what I call evasive maneuvers. Ah, this is Berlin all over again. Yeah, take some of that. Do you see that? That thing almost hit me. I ain't getting turned into a pancake. like one long bowling alley knocking pins down. Okay, I get it. Come get some.
almost there. Good job. We've lost most of them. I'm alive! I can't believe it! Immediately proceed with the container to the rendezvous point and turn off the radio. Yeah, sure. Wet blanket, I can still hear you. What? Yeah, well, good. Good luck using your busted ass device now. I can see you, old man. Nice bowling through that car park, by the way. That's you, Cam? Yeah, I hacked into the closed circuit camera. I can see your every move. Nah, that's not creepy at all. Stay sharp, Roman. Your friends are back. Hey, big boss man. I didn't know they'd be dragging you away from whatever you're doing in that warehouse. Bravo, bravo. Excellent work, Mr. Pierce. Everything I heard about you and your crew is true. My crew? No, nah, I'm a lone wolf wheelman. You know that. Right, Lamar? Oh, I'm sure that Dominic Toretto would be disappointed to hear you say that. And Laddie Ortiz. Who I'm sure is watching us also. Possibly even Tesh Parker or that Goliath Hobbs. Roman, get out of there! I don't know who you're talking to, but it's just me. I got your fancy toy and everything. And is that all you brought, Mr. Pierce? Okay. Which one of y'all put that piece of junk in my trunk? Spare us! Your predilection for braggadocio has proven to be your worst enemy. What did he just say? Like I said before, you talk too much. We know all about your family. To those of you who are watching, let me be brief. I have an important business on a very short timeline. If you or any other member of your team attempt to disrupt my experiment, Mr. Pierce will pay the price. <laughs> and believe me, I'll make your death last a very long time. vouched for him, no? You know what to do now. We're just gonna let them take Roman? Hey, guys. Trust me, that ain't gonna happen. How do we make a move without getting him killed? Guys! What is it? Ormstrid may have turned the scrambler off, but would you be interested to know about the tracking device I put in Roman's car before we dropped it off? Now look who's turned pro. 